Hey YouTube, Dan here from EAP Films Official and today I'm going to be reacting to uh, Regine Velasquez. Um, I don't even know what this is actually. Um, it says Kaya Parbang Bumirit ni Regine Velasquez, Noon vs Nangayon. I, I have no idea what this video is going to be. <laughs> so let's, uh, let's find out. I've noticed the hashtag is Regina on GGV, so it's a very recent performance. I know that. Um, let's jump straight in, figure out what this is all about. <laughs> Remember this one? Whoa, it just all takes it up a notch. I love that. Oh, I see. So it's it's comparing. Oh, Jesus. Pretty high. My favorite performance of Nare Toako. That's the same key as well, that's really good. So, yeah, it's just comparing sort of older regime to new regime. Not new regime, but just showing that she can still do it. this performance. Still going. <laughs> She's still got it. You go, get him, girl. <laughs> wow. So, what have we learned here, guys? What have we learned? Well, we've learned that Regine still has it. No matter what the haters say. Now, I'm going to kind of go off on a bit of a rant here. Because recently I posted um, a tweet on Twitter talking about the stupidity of people's loyalty to a network and not an artist. And the analogy I gave was if you went shopping with your mom for 20 years to the same store and one day... She decides to go to a different store. There's more options for groceries. But do you hate her? Do you uh, insult her? Publicly humiliate or try and publicly humiliate her? And do you refuse to go into the store? Or is that just really stupid? Because that's how I see Regine. It, you know, she's gone to another network. She's going to be 
she's presumably doing more performances. She's going to be doing, um, you know, more concerts, probably internationally. Don't know. Um, the ASAP um, segment. There's probably a lot more opportunity there for her than there was at GMA. Um, it doesn't matter where she goes, ABS, CBN, whether she goes to a whole other network entirely, when she, if she goes internationally and, and joins the different, it doesn't matter. If you love somebody that much, if you idolize your songbird as you say you do, you will love her no matter where she goes. That's how support works. It's support for the artist. Irrespective of what GMA have done for Regine, she's also worked her ass off to make sure that you know she she's on top form. That, you know she pulls in the ratings. Uh, GMA. She's worked her. She's rightfully worked her way up in GMA. So it isn't like she owes them anything. She's worked for it, and it's the same. You know, I don't, so people who say, "Oh, she she's replaceable. She's this. She's that." Do you know what? Go and do one because she doesn't need that hate in her life. She doesn't need to perform anymore. She's done 30 plus years in the industry. She's got a child. You know, if I was her, in fact, no, it doesn't matter what I think. She doesn't need to prove herself anymore. She doesn't even need to perform anymore. She could quite easily retire and just focus on the family. And I guess a lot of people would do that. So she owes you nothing, and yet people just, you know, think that they can tell her what to do and how to do it. Um, and I just, I can't believe people are so hateful because of Regine's switch. It's just stupid. It's ridiculous. I don't understand it. I don't want to understand it. It's backward thinking. It's, it's immature. And you guys, whoever you are, if you're watching this video and you hate Regine because of her network switch, then you can get off my channel because I don't even want you on here. It's disrespectful to the artist, disrespectful for the family and friends of Regine, um, and disrespectful and embarrassing for all the fans out there who do support her still. I'm kind of hoping that the people who are disrespectful and are that are hateful towards Regine are just a minority because you guys can just go away, hide under a rock, no one cares about your worthless lives. <laughs> I quite like this ranting stuff, it's quite funny. But yeah, whatever you guys think, I don't care. I will always support Regina no matter where she is, and that's how, that's how it should be. You don't just stop, like, you know, again, going back to your family, if your mum suddenly turns around and says to you, oh, by the way, I'm not gonna go shopping at the store anymore. I'm gonna shop at this store. There's a bit, bit more groceries to choose from, but I just fancy going to a different store for a change, uh, see what they've got. You wouldn't just turn around and just hate her and, and just, can you see my point? It's ridiculous. You just go, yeah, okay. She's going to a different store, fine. We'll just shop from there instead. Regine, different network, but I'm excited to see where Regine's gonna go and what she's gonna do. Um, and I'm I'm kind of hoping ABS-CBN will give her the opportunity to to do more than she could ever do before. Proper, you know, professional music videos, albums, a performance and and guest um, guest performances and concerts. You know, I just can't. I just I'm excited. I want to see where she's going to go next. This didn't mean to turn into a bit of a rant video, but I kind of wanted to—I I, kind of wanted to address the recent public um, reaction, I guess, to Regine's switch. But honestly, for me, as long as she's happy, and as long as she's got the support from the majority of her fans, it should be all of her fans. But as long as she's got the main support there, then I'm really happy for her, and I can't wait to see where she is next. So that's my reaction. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And we'll see you next time.